Hey, how's it going? Well, I like to go to a lot of video chat sites, like Tiny Chat, which Doja Cat surprisingly goes to sometimes. I think the last time I was in a room that she was in, she called me Cowboy Man, or it was something like that, because I had the hat on at the time, right? And then I go to Stumble Chat, which is a competitor to Tiny Chat. Stumble Chat technically actually has a much better product than Tiny Chat, and you can make rooms for free, but it's not as popular. Stumble Chat is ran by one person, whereas Tiny Chat is ran by a company that owns a bunch of other websites. Sometimes I'll go in StreamYard Hangouts on YouTube. Maybe once a week, something like that, I'll check Paltalk or Camfrog, but they both kind of suck. They, they both have interfaces that look like they were made in like 2003-2004. They're both awful for their own reasons. And I can't seem to consistently find good video chats on Discord unless I were to go f figure out a very specific schedule and then I could maybe do that. But I don't know of anywhere I can just randomly go on Discord and suddenly there's an interesting discussion of some sort, right? But then again, I like the rooms that talk about politics and current events and things like that. I know a few Discord servers that do talk about some of that stuff, but they don't allow video. So it's just like, eh, eh, eh. In one room that I was in for a short time in Tiny Chat, people were talking about how they don't understand how people can be so snobbish when it comes to the lyrics of music. How people will dunk on songs just because they're not saying anything deep or meaningful. As I said, I didn't stay long because I knew I wouldn't fit in. There wasn't really anywhere I could insert something that wouldn't potentially cause, a, <laughs> cause quite a stir, and I just didn't, wasn't prepared for that at the time. But, but that's usual with that particular room. I came in knowing that I probably wouldn't fit in. I just wanted to see what they were talking about. But, uh, but you know, after I listened to them talk about this for several minutes, you know, and I left, I, I thought about what they talked about for quite a while. For myself, if a song has lyrics that just pretty much sound like a bunch of pleasant-sounding phrases thrown together, I can hang with that. Take most of Seal's music, for instance. I love Seal's music, his music, the stuff that he has written. I'm not as much into the his cover music, but, uh... I mean, yeah, he has a unique voice, but I prefer listening to the stuff that he's written. But Seal's lyrics aren't really actually very good at all. They fit the music, and I remember most of them, but they don't really mean anything. I really like 1970s, yes, but John Anderson's lyrics are just rubbish. But I still like it. Same with Alice Cooper's second album entitled Easy Action. This was from before he got schooled on how to write hits. This is, this is before he did makeup. I enjoy the album, but the lyrics are just terrible. I mean, terrible. But, you know, as I had listened, that's not the kind of thing that they were talking about in that room. This was more about songs that prop up materialism, hedonism, maybe some things that people might consider degenerate, rather than songs that talk about relationships, feelings other than pleasure, social issues, or current events. The kind of music they were playing that they were calling people snobs for not being able to get into was primarily mumble rap, where the only words you can really understand that just kind of stand out once in a while are club, uh, the N-word, booty, hose, paper, jams, bass, and whatever stupid phrase they kept repeating over and over again. You know, I still wonder, you know, if I would have been able to talk about artists like Seal, Yes, and Alice Cooper, I wonder how they would have responded. When someone talks about music that has lyrics that are not deep or meaningful, what do you think of? You know, what comes to mind? Do you think of music that props up our basic instincts and that side of things? Or do you think of lyrics that don't really say anything at all? Or something else? Let me know in the comments. Thanks.